Hi everyone, this is Yvette from My World of Metaphysics. And some of you are probably saying, oh my God, Yvette, I missed the 7-7-2023 portal, the 777 portal. And some of you might be saying, oh my God, Yvette, not only did I miss the 77 portal, but I also missed the 716 portal. Well, listen, no fears, everyone. I'm here to tell you today that we got one more 777 portal for this month, and that is July 25th, 2023. Now this is a special day and it's a little different from the others. So I want you to watch this all the way to the end because I'm going to tell you guys exactly what you need to be doing to be moving on in your life, to actually be getting in alignment with what it is that you want so that you can manifest it. But before we get started, if you're new to this channel, this is a metaphysical law of attraction channel that gives you manifesting techniques in all ways. So don't forget to support this channel by liking, subscribing, tapping the bell, and most of all, keep watching the videos. So now if you want to know what you should be doing for July 25th, 2023, keep watching. Okay, everyone. July 25th, 2023 is a special day. It's a 777 portal. July 7, 25th breaks down to 7, and 2023 breaks down to 7. 777. Another reason why this day is so special for me is because it's my birthday, everyone. Not only is it my birthday, but I was also born on a 777 portal many, many years ago, everyone. So I came in on a 777 portal. Wow. So now what am I telling you that's different on this day than the other two days? Um, seven, July 7th fell on a Friday and it was during a new moon. And July 16th fell on a Sunday and it was a waning moon. Now, July 25th is falling on a Tuesday and it is a waxing moon. Now, if you watch the other 777 portal um, videos, which are in the description, you will know that the 777 portal is not about running around making money. It's not all about running to the casino or running around doing all different types of things to manifest whatever it is you want in your life. It's about getting in alignment with who you are, okay? This is important, you guys. Getting in alignment with who you are is how you're going to manifest whatever it is that you want, okay? So when I'm talking about getting in alignment, you cannot manifest anything in your life if you're not in alignment with who you are. You will manifest, but you will manifest what is not for you. Once you are in alignment with who you are, you are then saying, this is who I am, I know what it is I want, I'm going in that direction, anything else has to go. And that is what the 777 portal is all about. So when I think of the 777 portal, I'm thinking of seven in the morning, seven at night. I'm thinking of getting in alignment with myself by meditation, prayer work, um, doing mirror work, anything to get me back in tune with who I am. I tell you this because if you don't get yourself in alignment, you're going to keep looking for things that is just not for you. Hey, look, Yvette, I'm going to get that job. And then you get it and you're like, oh, my God, Yvette, it was the worst ever. It's just who it's just not who I am. When you are in alignment with yourself, you tend to go in the direction of what is for you. You tend to get out of those relationships that you know just weren't for you. And then you start opening up to people like-minded, people that are like you. And this is the reason for the 777 portal. So again, it's falling on a Tuesday. Tuesday is the day of Mars, everyone. And this is a day of getting things done. For us at this moment, we're talking about getting in alignment, becoming one, um, getting into your spirituality to know what it is that you want in your life. Now, because it's a waxing moon, this takes us to the next level, everyone. Now, we all know the waxing moon is for growth. So you can basically use the 777 portal to get in alignment with who you are, focus on what it is you really want in life, and then the next day, take action because we are in a waxing moon. Take action in the direction of whatever it is. 
So we're going to look at the 777 portal of this is the side where I'm at. I'm getting in alignment with who I am. And then I am walking through that portal into the world of where I'm supposed to be. And that basically will sum up what the 777 portal is. So for the 777 portal on July 25th, what would I be doing on that day? Seven o'clock, I might be seven in the morning or seven at night. I might be saying some prayer work. I might be speaking to God. I might be doing mirror work, trying to release whatever's inside of me that needs to go. I might be sitting back saying, Yvette, what is it that you want in life? And what is it that needs to go? I might then say, what am I planning to do? What is, what is the necessary steps that I need to take in my life to get where I want to go? And then start making plans to do these things after the 777 portal. Now, what are some other things that I might do on this day? Again, I might do meditation. I might sit in quiet. I might walk in nature like I'm doing right now. I might do mirror work. I might just speak and talk to God or talk to my angels or my higher self. Now on this day, you might say a prayer and you might say something like, God, thank you for waking me up. Thank you, God, for giving me life. God, thank you for allowing me to have what I have at this moment. I am very grateful. At this moment, we are in a 777 portal. And at this, at this point, I am releasing whatever it is in my life that's no longer for me. I know, God, that I have to get in alignment with who I am and open the doors for whatever it is, God, that is out there for me. God, I'm asking you to give me guidance, to give me direction so that I can live the life that is meant for me to live. It is just that simple. You might want to talk to your angels, your archangels, your spiritual guides. These are the things I would do and contemplate on basically what is it that you came here to do? What is it you're supposed to be doing? And then after that, take action. Listen, you cannot manifest anything in your life if you are out of alignment, if you don't know who you are, if you don't know what you came here to do, if you're not following your passions and your talents, which God gave you to lead you in the right direction. God gave each and every one of us a passion to do something, a talent to do something. Even if it's just speaking, even if it's just getting along with people, that is still a talent, okay? And you can use it for a whole lot of things. When it comes down to the 777 portal, it's the time for you to sit back, get into oneness with who you are, get in alignment, you get into your spirituality and learn what it is you came here for. If you still don't know, follow your talents and follow your passions and it will lead you to the right place. Again, it's falling on a Tuesday this year. Tuesday is the day of getting things done, okay? And a waxing moon is a day for things to grow. So this to me is a perfect time to do the legwork on 725 and then walk through that portal to whatever it is you want in your life. So whatever it is that you want, you want to write that book, you want to start that business, you want to finish going to school, this is the time to sit back and realize what it is you're supposed to be doing, what is in alignment with you, and get out there and do it. So listen, this is Yvette from My World of Metaphysics. If you want to know anything about My World of Metaphysics, please look in the description. If you want to support this channel, don't forget to like, subscribe, tap the bell, and again, most of all, watch the next video. Again, happy 777 portal, happy July 25th, happy birthday to me, and namaste.